Hello and welcome to yet another episode of Quality Control by Presto. We are committed to helping you choose the right equipment for your laboratory. And my name is Vishal Malhotra and I'm your quality coach. Today we're going to talk about the coefficient of friction, which is a very important instrument in your laboratory in case you're dealing with laminates. This particular equipment, we are not going to showcase you how it works because there are already a lot of videos on this channel with, where you can know how it works. Today we are going to discuss about the finer aspects of checking the coefficient of friction. A lot of people ask me what are the units of the coefficient of friction. Well, the unit of coefficient of friction is mu. There is no unit of friction. Secondly, a lot of people ask how many time types of friction are there? Well, there are two types of friction. Static coefficient of friction and the dynamic coefficient of friction. This particular equipment helps you do both of them. We have the indicator, the drive. Always, whenever you do your coefficient of friction, make sure you know at what speed you are checking. We have a drive installed over here which will help you make sure you set the right speed. Also, there should be no wobble in the equipment. If I'm starting this equipment now, if you can see, it has to be ultra smooth. If there are wobbles, then you can be sure that there is error in the readings. So whenever you buy an equipment, make sure it is so smooth. We at Presto use imported ball screws so that there is no friction because we are committed to giving you the best possible value for your money. Thank you so much for watching this video and in case you still have any queries, mail us at info at prestogroup.com and also don't forget to subscribe to the, this YouTube channel. We look forward to your comments and we are always committed to serving you. Thank you so much for watching this video.